Hello my fellow ACADs, this is Liz. I'm an HP certified technician and we're going to go over how to install Windows 11 on your HP from a USB. Okay, so how to install Windows 11. First thing, you're going to need to make a bootable Windows 11 USB. Uh, down below is a link on how to do that free at Microsoft.com. Now you're going to take your HP, you're going to plug that USB in that you've already created on Microsoft.com for free. I also have a link to the USB I used. Hit power and you're going to tap on F9. Uh, also some models of HP you need to hit escape and then F9. So if F9 doesn't work, try escape. Then you're going to select your USB and hit enter. USB. Uh, if you find it doesn't show up, maybe try a different port. It's going to start up like this and it's going to do a bunch of stuff that looks like this before you get to the page you need. Okay, so now I'm at the setup window. I hit next and then install now. You accept all the, that little checkbox right there and then hit next, custom install. Now we're gonna delete all these partitions off of, if you have two hard drives, only delete them off of the hard drive you want to install Windows on. But for me, I have one hard drive, so I'm just gonna go ahead and delete everything. As a side note, you will lose all your information when you delete it. So I select the drive and hit next. Now this process will simply just take some time. It's gonna do, do the getting ready files, ready for installation, you get your features, your updates. Each one of these steps takes a while. I'm gonna fast forward it a little bit so that we don't have to wait. And then it's gonna restart a couple times possibly. Um, you're gonna get a couple different screens. All right, so now we're at the Windows 11 setup screen. Exciting, isn't it? Okay, so I'm in the United States, so that's what I'm picking. And then I hit yes. And then I keyboard, yes. I don't need an additional keyboard, so I'm gonna hit skip. I am not going to say I have internet. I'm going to set that up when I get in there because I don't want to be forced to sign in with my Microsoft account. I'm just going to make a local account with my name. I was going to put Dell, but you know what? I'll put my actual name. And hit next. I'll set up the password later. And I hit next for the privacy and accept. And then it's just gonna load a little bit more. We're in the home stretch at this point, almost done. Depending on your computer, this can take uh, you know a varying amount of time. So be patient with your computer. Ta-da! Windows 11. So that is how you go about installing Windows 11 on your computer. Have any questions? Leave them down below. Thank you for your continued support of our channel, both through subscribing and through Patreon. Also, a big shout out to our fellow eggheads who purchase merchandise from our store. And as always, thank you for liking and sharing our videos. From one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out.